Hi everyone, it's Nisha. So today I wanted to um, show you and demonstrate for you this new tool that I got, which is called Time, Time Iron. And I was very, very intrigued by this iron because it is not like any other iron. So I don't know if you can see the way it closes. It is not Mm. yeah it is not like straight like any straightening iron anyway this tool um, can straighten your hair or curl your hair depends how you hold it um, so it takes a bit of practice to with with the holding technique but if you remember just these three things you'll be fine also whenever you purchase one of those you can um, arrange like a skype call with one of these stylists which i did actually uh with genevieve she was lovely and they will walk you through and um, show you exactly what to do i thought i knew what to do and i thought i won't bother with the skype call but i did and i'm glad i did because she really cleared up some things for me uh, so i will first show you um with the iron switched off how to use it and then I will turn it on um, one thing you have to remember is when you clamp your hair never ever to squeeze it too hard because this iron is not like an iron that you know straightening iron that closes like that these plates come together can you see, I don't know if I'm explaining myself well. So imagine this is the straightening iron. It goes like this. So of course, when you clamp your hair, you have to put some pressure on it to hold it. But this iron comes, the plates come together that way. So you never ever squeeze your hair really hard in, in this iron. Okay, so first very important thing to remember to know how to hold your iron you need to remember this side so this side is this is the side that curls your hair so can you see those guidelines here and this side where you can actually see the plates is the straightening side and this is very important because if you want to curl your hair the guidelines need to be always towards your head so that's the first thing second thing the on button whenever you hold your iron remember your thumb always needs to be behind that and that will help you with the guidelines how to hold them um, how to hold the iron so you always put your thumb behind the on button so if you curl in your hair if you curl in this side, the guidelines need to be towards your head. So you will have to go over your head for this side. And then for this side, your guidelines need to be like this. So you will be holding iron that way. Okay. So that's really all you need to remember. If you want to straighten your hair, you still put your thumb behind um, the on off button but you will hold your iron with the shiny plates towards your head and when you straighten make sure that your that this guideline you see here points downwards okay so if i want to curl i have my thumb behind the on off button i will grab a section now I make sure that the guidelines are towards my head. I clamp my hair not too hard, twist, and then just go like this. And I will show you uh, much more while I actually turn the iron on. So on this side, I will take a section of my hair, thumb behind the on button, guidelines towards my head, twist and 
run it forward now it is a bit different when you've got long hair it's probably easier when you've got really long hair it's more difficult with my, my hair being um being um, layered as well so i'll also leave you the link to the youtube channel because i've watched loads of their tutorials the owner actually does the tutorials um and they are very very helpful they even do like live streaming where people ask questions so they are very helpful uh, they have sent me this iron um because i was just really intrigued by this strange shape of it okay so i'm going to turn it on you only press that button and it flashes and when it's ready it stops flashing by the way you can the time company um is in US, us and we have our own here in the uk because i got one with a uk plug so i'm going to just section my hair to two sections because as you can see the top section is much shorter Um, this hair that you can see I just washed yesterday I didn't do anything to it I slept on it and that's what my hair looks like now okay my iron is you start from the back really but obviously I'm not going to be doing the back because you can see it if you have uh, layered hair and quite short hair it's best to do it with small sections and the sections should go that way small no, if you if you get what I'm saying not that way okay not that way but down so you pick a section and the trick also is to then bring this section forward so you hold it forward okay I'm putting my thumb behind the on off button these are my guide guidelines so i'm putting them towards my head i clamp my hair i twist and then i just pull towards me and there is first cow let's do another one So pull your hair forward thumb behind the on off button these are the guidelines towards my head clamp twist and pull forward and they are just beautiful beachy waves you can stop at the end so you can have your your ends straight there is so many things and different curls you can do but obviously it would be very difficult for me to show you on my head that's why i really advise that um you go and watch their videos because they do it obviously on people with all sorts of um, lengths of hair So once you know what you're doing, it is very, very easy. Okay, let's do this side. So again, thumb behind there. These are my guidelines. They go towards my head. And they go just. Okay, I will let this head down so maybe you will see a bit better when I now with the back because I have quite layered and short hair I don't want um, curls as such there what I do with with this bit um, I just curl it huh, curl it under like this so it gives me that bump so that's what I would do at the top of my hair. Okay, let's pick out a section. Now make sure also that your section is not wider than the plate. Okay, 
pull the hair forward thumb behind the on off button guidelines towards the head clamp the hair twist and pull forward and depends how curly uh, you want your individual curls is how you hold the iron and this is all just practice uh, if you have um, like I said if you watch their videos you will learn in no time Yes, yeah, so I think it is a lovely little tool and once you once you get the hang of it then you can do your hair really really quickly right I always have a problem with what to do with this bit so I will tackle that later I love it. You know you see people they have those lovely beachy waves and this is just going to give you that. quite good just to do a little work also you will see later how much body you get from it let's tackle this thing oh. yeah that's fine and then you know when you've got long hair it's much easier but with shorter hair I've just pick up any bit um, that I want to do because you don't have to um, curl every little bit you know so this video is just I just wanted to show you um, almost like the mechanics of it but um, one day I will do a tutorial when I curl uh, my whole hair but whole head but I just wanted to show you the mechanics because you do need to um, almost change your way of thinking because it's totally different way that you curl your hair it's not like you do it with straightening irons but once you remember these three things you know thumb behind the on off switch guidelines always towards your head when you want to curl your hair and um, to pull your hair all, always forward towards you towards your nose um, then it becomes really easy so I thought I'd show you that but one day I will I will do my whole hair with it like we do get ready with me or something can you see you get this lovely corkscrew so I won't care anymore I'll just show you in a minute when um, when the curls cool down that even if you don't want to have the whole head you know in those spiral curls if you just do few of this here and there it does give you a lot of body okay so after I do this you saw how flat my hair was look at the body you get with that so um yeah i'm i'm really happy with it i really really like it 
um, like I said, if you, I would watch the things and if you decide to buy this iron, I would book myself a session because even when I thought I knew what I was doing and I started doing the cow, that's when Genevieve would tell me, no, you need to hold it that way. And once you got these things, you on your way it is nothing to it i think it's just almost like changing our way of thinking when it comes to curling hair because we are used to to curl it all with a curling wand or with straightening iron but this is totally different in fact i haven't never seen anything like it that's why i was so intrigued about it okay my lovelies um I don't have any discount codes. I think I just give you the link to the website in US and, and UK. Um, and that's it really. Okay, so I hope you liked it. Thank you for watching and I see you soon. Stay fabulous. Bye.